I'm Bernard, Cloud Consultant for Business Communications, and I rate the Microsoft Project application a 5 out of 5. For more reviews about Microsoft Project, click below. Before using Microsoft Project, I was primarily using manual processes and spreadsheets and fairly non-sophisticated tools, but you reach a point where you find that those tools are just not giving you the level of visibility into projects and that a more sophisticated tool for projections and for understanding if you're going to meet deadlines is going to happen, uh, a, a tool like Project is certainly far more appropriate for that. And that's why the switch was made. The reason for choosing Microsoft Project was really based on my own familiarity using Microsoft Project in previous companies and with previous projects. Microsoft Project is a fairly sophisticated product, similar to Microsoft Excel. If you're familiar with Microsoft Excel, it's easy to add up a column of numbers, and then you'll learn about formulas like averages, and you might learn about pivot tables, and you might look at you know, fancy lookup tables and so on. And so it really depends on your overall familiarity of the product to get the most out of it. And so having a background with Microsoft Project really led to that being the most logical solution to use. The ability to onboard Microsoft Project and use it effectively is really dependent on the familiarity of the users. It's similar to as I mentioned to with Excel. If you want to learn the basics of managing a project, that is defining you know, timeline objectives and resources and dependencies, it's fairly easy to do. But if you want to start adding you know, budgets and more advanced formulas for predicting what costs will be and what timelines can be met, Microsoft Project really requires a fair amount of familiarity and training. Now, fortunately, there's a lot of training resources online and individuals who are extremely familiar with the application itself. It's sort of like having a Cisco certified network engineer on your staff. That's a, you know, Cisco products are extremely sophisticated, but they are by far the best. And so it's created an entire industry of people who, in this case, know Microsoft Project and can really help you get started and can even be your, your project manager for it. But overall, it's a terrific product. And I would say that if you have the familiarity with it, it can become an extremely effective resource for ensuring projects and goals are met. My recommendation for using or selecting Microsoft Project really depends on who is going to use it, which may not sound obvious. If it's a fairly large project, you might actually have a dedicated Microsoft Project Manager running the Gantt charts and entering the information. As I mentioned earlier, there are people that have made that their entire career and are very proficient with it, and that can result in projects being extremely effective and well-managed overall. Now, if you're running it yourself, that really takes a bit of a commitment to learn how to get the most out of the product. And there are, as I mentioned, many different online resources, and so that you know, in a matter of maybe a week or two, you can become proficient enough to get the most out of the product. And if you spent, you know, a month on the product and get more and more familiarity with it, then you'll find that you'll start to use the more advanced features for projections and calculations and more collaboration with team members. But overall, I highly recommend the solution. It's really the, the benchmark standard for all. And there are other solutions in the market as well, but none of them really have the same power of really the world's leading product, that being Microsoft Project.